Alright, welcome back to another CTR Nitro Fueled video and today we have another special video because I am going to be racing as my most used characters. Um, before I jump into this video, I gotta go through the comment of the day section. I based this video topic um, on a comment of you guys. Um, the first comment comes from Steven was taken and he says what are the three characters you use the most and that is what we are going to do in this episode. Thank you Steven for the video topic. Um, hopefully I will answer your question with this uh, with this video and the second comment comes from NorbJ15 and he or she says for some reason I thought Racer Crunch was the legendary character in the first Grand Prix and no it was actually Motorsport Tauna Crunch was the silver tier reward and I actually have a video coming up about all the silver tier rewards that we got so far before the Rustland Grand Prix but I might might include the next uh, silver tier reward in that video because the Rustland Grand Prix will be out when uh, when making that video. Anyway, we're going to jump into an online lobby. Um, I'm just gonna use the standard card though. Uh, yeah, that one. And the first character I use most is actually one of the original characters, and that is uh, Neo Cortex. I'm actually never using legendary skins when I use uh, Cortex. I'm an OG player. I played this game when this uh, when this game came out in 1999. I think I was like four years old or something. Or I started the game when I was five so the game was out like one year or something. And um, yeah, so I'm an OG player. Cortex was my favorite player uh, or character on that game. So uh, I use Cortex a lot when, I, uh, when I'm not recording. When I'm recording, of course, I'm always using random characters because I want to switch up um, the characters I use in my videos. But when I'm not recording, I actually really like to race as Cortex. I actually also have a figurine of Cortex in his cart using this exact um, setup um, on my desk. And I will make a series once I buy every um, figurine possible. Um, and then I will make a series though, because there's, I think, six figurines. You have Cortex, Polar, um, Nitrous Oxide, Coco, Ripperoo, and, and one more, but I can't really uh, remember. Clockwork Wampa though, that is going to be the first race of the episode, so without further ado, let's go. I am really excited for the next Grand Prix, the Rustland Grand Prix. I'm not too sure when this video is coming out, but so far we don't really have information about uh, about the new Grand Prix. The only thing we know is that we are getting Mega Mix as a uh, as a racer, and so far that's the only character we know that we're getting. Oh wait, do I hear Entropy behind me? Oh yeah, Megumi. Frick you! But yeah, the only character we know is that Mega Mix character. Not too sure how to feel about it though. Oh, don't be hitting me. Um, he's a cool character though, but I think uh, we've only seen him in like a, a Game Boy game or something. I'm, I'm not too sure, like a really old game though. I'm not too sure what game. But uh, we've seen him once and he was really... It was really weird. You turning... Oh yeah. Perfect. Megumi is still behind us. Oh no, how did we lose the blue flames? Come on. Oh yeah, let's hope we can uh, we can hit her with that. I really like what Binox is doing, like not really showing too much with the uh, data mining and stuff. Um, because we can be really, uh, really excited about uh, upcoming Grand Prix. Because we don't know anything about it, you know? It's more fun when we don't really know anything about it. In my opinion at least. I don't want to know what we're getting. Hopefully we're getting like a new mode. Are you kidding me? Right before, right after I got the uh, the Sacred Fire, bro, or the Ultimate Sacred Fire. That kind of sucks. It's gonna hit me. Yep. Oh, my Gumi didn't even get hit. Are you kidding me? Oh, we're yes. didn't even hit her. Yep, of course, of course. Of course that needed to happen, bro. That was just really unlucky that that um, warp orb 
Ah, I really hate orb orbs, bro. But to be fair, you don't really see them as much. But that could have been a first place finish if we didn't get wrecked by that stupid warp orb. Oh well, Cortex, you did well. It was fun racing as you, brother. But that's the uh, that's the first race down. Ah, sucks though. She was playing as an acceleration character. You don't really see it as much um, in the online mode. Gosh dang it though, I'm kind of uh, kind of annoyed. Let's see if we can beat that Megumi in the next races. If only that warp orb was juiced up so it hit everyone, we would have won this game, but of course not. Of course the guy that actually used it <sighs> didn't have uh, the max wampa fruit. It's kind of annoying. It's gonna throw us out? Yeah, of course. We can't even know if we if we would beat that Megumi character. Come on, it this needs to stop happening. Once you're in the lobby, you Oh, you have to stay in that lobby. You need to be able to stay and not just get randomly thrown out. It's kind of annoying though. Anyway, the next character I use most and this might surprise you guys, but it actually is Liz. Um, Liz is one of my uh, favorite characters on this game as well. Um, I'm not too sure why, but she just is. She really has uh, some cool um, some cool voice lines like uh, your mom's an armadillo. Really like that one. I'm not too sure what card we're gonna be using, I'm just gonna go, like, pick random cards. Uh, I think she had the green paint job, um, if I remember correctly. No, no, that's Amy. Amy had green. Liz had, like, I'm not too sure, but we're just gonna use the, the gold paint job here. It, it threw us out of the lobby again. I swear, this game sometimes it gets on my nerves, bro. Um, and we're gonna use the uh, Spyromobile. Um, wheels that's a really cool setup i got the max alternative skin for uh, for liz before the introduction of uh, engine swap so i did it with the turning driving style the ocelot liz um and that was a pain in the ass to get because i really wanted to get that final skin it looked really cool and then right when i got it um binox adds engine swaps so <laughs> i was really annoyed because of that but thankfully they uh, implemented engine swaps because it's it's really cool you can use any character you want before you couldn't really race as Liz or or baby crash because they were turning characters and right now you can actually race as any character you want jungle boogie though not really too sure how to feel about this track. Wow, the gold looks really cool on this card. Um, I'm working towards the uh, the Platinum Relic as well. Hopefully I can get it soon. Or I can actually make a series about it if you guys uh, if you guys want to as well. Oh no, the guy the guy behind me got absolutely wrecked. I feel I feel really bad for him. Please don't wreck me right now. This is uh, it's necessary that I got this uh, this drift off. Perfect. Wow, they're actually uh, far behind me. This episode, I got really lucky with um, with not getting hit. It's really good. So far, we still have that tiny behind me, and I actually remember the uh, the name. So he is a good racer. So if I mess up, like I'm doing right now, kind of, um, that might be the end of me, though. I mean, we still have a really good lead here. I'm not gonna take that shortcut because it can mess you up if you miss the uh, if you miss the jump. I would rather keep the keep the sacred fire here. Tiny is coming closer, trying to uh, to shoot me with rockets, but because he got hit at the start of the race, um, he can't really catch up to me anymore. There we have it. We are victorious as Liz. That's a really cool card combination. I wish there was like an option in this game to keep the customization like a preset. Like you can add presets, but... Oh no, Tiny Tiger. Wow, the guy that was in second actually left the game. Because he got hit like several times, I think. Oh, I feel really bad for him though. Whew, that must be annoying as hell. And there we have it though, the first place finish of the episode, right now I'm happy. As soon as I get the first place finish, it doesn't really matter how I perform 
in the uh, in the video anymore. I just want to win at least one race in every single uh, every single episode. Anyway, the next character we are going to use, or the next character I use the most, is actually Koala Kong. I am still working towards his final skin, but uh, I do have uh, I do have a lot of races with him. I'm just not really as lucky. But uh, I really like using uh, using Koala Kong. I'm gonna be using some really ugly ass paint job though, or um, decal. I mean, never gonna use that. That's actually not too bad of a uh, of a setup on Gingerbread Joyride. That's gonna be amazing though. But Koala Kong is just. I was really really happy when they uh, when they added him to the game. I was really looking forward to Koala Kong. He's just in my eyes one of the coolest characters in the Crash universe. Now the reason why I don't have the final skin for Koala Kong is actually because I have of course favorite characters, like really cool characters that I like to play as, but I do switch a lot because I feel like playing with different characters is like really really fun. And that's why uh, that's why I do that. Oh, if I if only I can hit that stupid ass Coco, that would be nice. Oh no, I'm going to lose it. I'm going to lose fire. Maybe, maybe not. Okay, please. Oh yes. Wow, fake uh, or baby crash is like really close to me as well. Still got the uh, got the blue flames. Well done, little buddy. But can you keep it here? Because it's really, really difficult to keep it here. You kind of need the um, the U turning here, I think. So far, we still got it though. We lost it right before the uh, the new boost pad. Maybe Crash is pretty good. I mean, he's keeping up, and I lost the uh, the blue flame as well because I was looking at the mini map. That's just my mistake. But uh, I'm not too sure. Yeah, he still got the blue flames. Oh no! Oh no! I I am panicking. I'm panicking. I'm not even keeping it in the perfect anymore. I'm not even drift boosting. Oh, baby, Crash got hit. That's good. It's all up to this one. All up to this one here. If I can take this shortcut and keep the blue flames, it's all up to this section of the map. Perfect. Oh yeah, I think we, we're gonna win this. If this guy doesn't really hit me... Oh, he kinda messed up there. There we go, there we go! Perfect! Keeping the blue flames over the finish line as well. Didn't even see that red potion, but luckily we didn't hit it. It wouldn't have mattered. That is another win with Koala Kong. Only five more wins for his, uh, his last skin. And I really want to unlock that skin because it's a really cool one. Oh yeah, flexing on him. Do it to him, Koala Kong. Show your muscles and shake that ass. <laughs> I just, it's a really weird victory celebration, but I like it. I really like it. I really like like it when he shakes his ass like that. Look at it. It's so tiny compared to all his muscles. He he forgot leg day, bro. Do you know what leg day is, Koala Kong? I assume he actually doesn't because those legs are skinny as hell. Anyway, that's gonna be it for this video, though. Let me guys know what your three most used characters or actually just favorite characters on this game um, are I think there's like 49 characters on this game so far with the next Grand Prix we we're gonna have over 50 characters which is like an absolute insane amount um, to think about it like when we st first started off this game I think we had like around 25 20 characters something like that right now having over 50 characters that that's only a dream of mine. 50 characters in a CTR game that was a dream of mine and right now Beanox I'm very thankful that you brought so many 
cool Crash um, Universe characters to the game and I can't be uh, be more happy. Anyway, let me guys know your favorite characters down below in the comment section, but I will end the video right here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it, if you did, please leave a like if you want to see more, then subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video.